Hey everyone, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create this animated travel slide using Canva. Open up your video project. Head over to either Elements or Uploads and add your image. Scale it so it fits nicely into the frame. I'm going to flip my image horizontally to get the angle I want. Now, let's add a title. Go to Text, click on the title, and type in your message. Change the font color to white. And under Effects, select the Lift effect to give it some depth. Place your text right in the middle of the screen for a clean, professional look. Next, hit Share. Download the current design as a PNG and save it to your device. This will be our background. Delete the text and the background image. Upload the PNG you just downloaded back into Canva and drag it onto the canvas. Make it bigger. Now for the fun part. Go to Elements and search for Real Plane Under Graphics. Choose one you like, add it to the page, and rotate it slightly for motion. Drag it to the left side and scale it up. Press the R key to add a rectangle. Stretch it across the canvas. This will serve as our background element. Pick a color that complements your image. I'll go with yellow. Press R again to add a second rectangle. Place it over the airplane wing. Change its color to match your theme. Then duplicate it and drag it to the opposite wing. Go to Position. Now select the airplane, drag it on top of the rectangles. With a plane selected, hold Shift, click on the last rectangle, and group all the elements together. Drag the grouped airplane off to the left until it disappears from view. Then duplicate the page. Return to the first page and add your main text, your message or call to action. Go to Animate and pick an animation effect. I'll use Baseline both for a smooth in and out motion. On the second page, drag the plane group to the right side of the screen until it disappears again. Then, add a match and move transition between the two pages. Don't forget to increase the duration to the full length for a smooth animation. Last step, click on the first page text. Trim the layer so it disappears the moment the plane starts entering the frame. This adds a nice touch of realism. And here's the final result. Thanks so much for watching. If you found this tutorial helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell so you never miss an update. See you in the next video.